Welcome to the Heidi Thorne Show. I'm your host, Heidi Thorne, and in this podcast, I share my real-world self-publishing and small business experience with you. Before we get started, I just want to remind you to like, comment, share, follow, and subscribe. Now let's get on with today's show. Big name record labels and musicians sell box sets or boxed sets and bundles. So do publishers and authors, especially the big ones. Can small self-published authors do it too? Yes, but like everything else, there's some things you need to know before you do them. What is a box set? For books, a box set is a collection of books that are sold together in a bundle, sometimes literally in a box. The price for the box set might be lower than the total if purchased separately. This provides a purchase incentive for buyers. A discounted price can lure readers into making a bulk purchase in a box set. Aside from that, it can be a way to boost sales of dated or slower selling content that doesn't sell well on its own. Also, during dry creativity periods, a box set of old material can be sold as a new release, possibly with some exclusive bonus content thrown in. Sometimes the bonus content is valuable to buyers, but if it's just scraps of unused or low quality content, it's not a selling point. Some books are natural sell togethers for a box set. For example, a trilogy is ideal as a box set. Book series are also a possibility. Authors who wish to rapid release their book series could also consider a box set offer. But when the number of books in the series is large, the high box set price, even if it represents a discount, might be a turnoff for buyers. In terms of genre, related fiction books are good candidates for box sets. Nonfiction can be more challenging. At least that's been my experience. So can you do a box set or bundle on KDP or Amazon? Yes and no, uh, depending on the format and selling options. Yes for Kindle eBooks. On Kindle Direct Publishing or KDP, you can combine the text for the ebooks you want to include in the box together in one manuscript document and publish that as a separate box set ebook offering. The same upload and publishing procedures as for other books on KDP apply, and this is the cheapest and most flexible option. You can also do a box set if all books fit into one physical print-on-demand book, but there are limits. Combining a collection of shorter print books into one bigger book is possible if the number of pages isn't large. KDP has a limit of 600 to 800 pages or so for print-on-demand books, and the limit depends on what paper and ink options you choose. It is not recommended for a box set of long novels. It's just too big. Uh, this is also a cheap and flexible option because it's print on demand. If you want to offer a volume discount for purchase of multiple books, Amazon does not allow authors to create a virtual box set or bundle, meaning offering discounts if buyers purchase a group of collected and selected books. This applies to both ebooks and print-on-demand books self-published through KDP. There is one more option, but I'm almost hesitant to talk about it because I don't want people to even consider it, especially for small self-published authors, and that is selling a physical box set through Fulfillment by Amazon or FBA. Fulfillment by Amazon would be used for physical box sets of print books. While there isn't a requirement that they technically be in a box, <laughs> they could even be grouped together and shrink-wrapped, 
Buyers are usually familiar with box set books they've seen in bookstores. The boxes can be the collectible component of the set. So it depends on your goals. Is the box set just a discount for purchasing multiple books, or is it a specially packaged collection? This is the most expensive of all box set options. The specially printed and manufactured box can be a very expensive custom printing project on top of the cost of printing the books. The custom printing may have minimums and setup fees. I used to do custom boxes for some of my past promotional products clients, so I know what it takes. If you don't have a strong history and forecast of sales, of the included titles, this could be a very high investment in manufacturing costs with questionable return. Even a non-box shrink wrap packaging will have a cost. And don't get stuck in the crafter's fantasy of creating a custom box component yourself. An arts and crafts packaging of your books would cost you plenty in materials and time that would eliminate your profits. And that's not all. Amazon FBA has monthly fees for warehousing and handling of your physical box set merchandise. There are selling fees, referral fees, fulfillment fees, inventory fees, cost of shipping your box sets to the fulfillment center, and more. So I would not recommend the FBA and custom packaging box set physical option for self-publishing it's just out of your budget. Here's why a box set didn't work for me. Some years ago, I collected many of my writings about self-publishing into shorter ebooks. Then I sold the whole lot of them as a box set of ebooks. A few of the individual titles got some play on Kindle Unlimited, but rarely regular sales. And the box set did nearly nothing. And I am in the process of unpublishing all of them. Here's why I think it didn't work for me. Usually people search for my content and get the answers they need from my blog post, a single book, or YouTube videos. That's the nature of a lot of nonfiction, especially the kind that I write. So a discount on a whole lot of my eBooks wasn't a selling point. You need to consider how people would logically consume your content to determine if a box set makes sense. Hope you found that helpful, and if you did, please rate, review, and subscribe to The Heidi Thorne Show on whatever podcast platform you like to use. I'm on all the major ones, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Stitcher, Podbean, Pick your favorite, I'm probably there. If you like the YouTube video better, all you have to do is subscribe to my Heidi Thorne YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell so you get an alert when a new video is up. I would appreciate it if you would share the audio or the video with your friends on social media. My self-published books, which are not in box sets, <laughs> are available on Amazon, Audible, and Apple Books. All you have to do is go to one of those sites, search for my name, Heidi Thorne, and a list of all of the available titles will come up. If you'd like to connect with me, my website is HeidiThorne.com, and I'm most active on the social channels of Instagram and TikTok, at, at Heidi Thorne. Thank you so much for listening and for your support. I look forward to talking with you again in the next episode. And in the meantime, have a great day.